Second test of the unisender dropping this 150-pound uh, rock. Uh, we're going to drop it 25 feet or so, 24 feet. It's going to drop into the unisender. That's about a factor one almost? Yeah, factor one. Factor one. Uh, we've got six feet of line underneath the unisender. Uh, let's see what happens. Fire in the hole! Yeah. What happened, Mark? Well, here we go. The Unisender once again did not bottom out. Here we are. Unisender stops. And rope is not substantially, whoa, <laughs> not substantially damaged. Dude, that's a big